Whether you want it or not, today I'm going to show you how money is printed. Start with paper. Unlike regular paper that uses wood pulp, U.S. currency is made from a unique blend of 75% cotton and 25% linen. The pulp is then fed into a specialized paper-making machine that forms large, continuous sheets of paper. These sheets are specifically designed for currency production, with security features already embedded within them. Tiny red and blue synthetic fibers are randomly distributed throughout the paper. These are visible to the naked eye and are a key security feature. The watermark portrait of Benjamin Franklin is embedded within the paper during production, not printed on later. This is visible from both sides when held up to the light. The 3D security ribbon is actually woven into the paper during the papermaking process. The ribbon is positioned vertically to the right of Benjamin Franklin's portrait, features images of bells and 100 that appear to move and change when the bill is tilted. The newly formed paper sheets are carefully dried and inspected for any imperfections. Only those meeting the stringent quality standards move on to the next stage. Throughout the design phase, security is paramount. The artists work closely with engraving and security experts to incorporate features that deter counterfeiting and make the bill easily identifiable as genuine. Once the design is finalized, highly skilled engravers take over. They meticulously translate the two-dimensional artwork into three-dimensional engravings on steel dies. These dies will serve as the master templates for printing the bill. The master die, engraved with the intricate design, is used to create multiple hubs through a process called hubbing. These hubs are essentially copies of the master die and serve as intermediaries in the plate making process. The hubs are then used to create the actual printing plates, which are made of a softer metal than the master die. This allows for mass production of the bills without wearing down the original engraving. The printing plates undergo a series of finishing processes, including polishing and hardening, to ensure they can withstand the rigors of high-speed printing. The Bureau of Engraving and Printing uses massive custom-built intaglio presses that exert tremendous pressure to transfer the ink from the recessed engravings on the printing plates to the paper. The printing plates are inked with a specialized, durable ink that is formulated to last for years. Each bill is assigned a unique serial number using high-speed numbering machines. These numbers help track the bill's circulation and aid in counterfeit detection. The Federal Reserve Seal, Treasury Seal, and Series Year are overprinted onto the bill using a separate printing process. These elements add further security and identification to the currency. Once the printing is complete, the large sheets are cut into individual bills using high-speed cutting machines. These machines ensure precise cuts and minimize waste. Throughout the printing process, automated inspection systems scan the sheets for any defects or inconsistencies. These systems use cameras and sensors to detect even the slightest deviations from the strict standards. Trained personnel also visually inspect the printed sheets and finished bills, checking for any imperfections that may have been missed by the automated systems. This meticulous attention to detail ensures that only the highest quality currency enters circulation. The bills are banded together in stacks of 100 and then packaged for distribution to Federal Reserve Banks across the country. The Federal Reserve Banks then distribute the new currency to commercial banks, where it eventually makes its way into the hands of the public. Now what about the Euro, Papa? Unlike the dollar's cotton linen blend, the Euro is made from 100% cotton fiber. This gives it a distinctive crispness and durability, crucial for a currency that changes hands frequently. During sheet formation, a watermark of the European gate and the numeral 100 is embedded into the paper. This watermark is visible when held against the light. A silver security thread is also embedded into the paper. It features the euro symbol and the numeral 100 in tiny microprint, and it glows pink under ultraviolet light. The paper sheets are carefully dried and inspected for any imperfections. Only flawless sheets proceed to the printing stage. Now we enter the fortress of banknote production, a place shrouded in secrecy and precision. Every step here is designed to deter counterfeiting and maintain the integrity of the euro. The first stage involves offset printing, which applies the base colors and some initial security features to both sides of the banknote. This includes the main image of the European architectural style, 
Baroque and Rococo for the 100 euros, and the background patterns. Silkscreen printing is employed to add the shimmering emerald number, a key security feature that changes color when the note is tilted. A holographic foil stripe is applied to the right side of the banknote. This stripe features a portrait of Europa, the architectural motif, and the euro symbol, all of which change appearance when the note is tilted. Intaglio printing is used to create raised tactile elements on the banknote. The portrait of Europa, from Greek mythology, the numeral 100, and other key design elements are printed using intaglio, giving the banknote its distinctive feel. Highly specialized printing presses, separate from the ones used for the main design, are employed for serial numbering. These machines utilize advanced inkjet technology to print unique serial numbers onto each banknote with incredible speed and precision. The serial numbers consist of a combination of letters and numbers, creating a vast array of unique identifiers. This helps track the banknotes throughout their lifespan and aids in counterfeit detection. The numbering machines print the serial numbers in sequential order, ensuring that no two banknotes have the same identifier. The printed banknotes undergo rigorous inspection, both automated and manual. Sophisticated machines scan for any deviations from the strict standards, while trained experts conduct visual checks to ensure every note is flawless. The European Central Bank, ECB, maintains stringent quality control standards to guarantee the integrity and uniformity of all Euro banknotes, regardless of where they are printed. Now that our banknotes have their unique identities and have passed rigorous quality checks, it's time for them to be prepared for their journey into the world. Giant guillotine-like cutters, equipped with laser-guided precision, slice through the large sheets of banknotes, separating them into individual notes. These machines ensure clean, accurate cuts, minimizing waste, and maximizing efficiency. The freshly cut banknotes are automatically stacked and counted by sophisticated machines, ensuring that each bundle contains the correct number of notes. These banded stacks are then wrapped in protective plastic film to shield them from moisture and damage during transport. The wrapped bundles are carefully placed into sturdy boxes, designed to withstand rough handling and ensure the banknotes remain pristine. Each box is clearly labeled with its contents, including the denomination, quantity, and destination. Throughout the cutting and packaging process, strict security measures are in place to prevent theft or tampering. Surveillance cameras monitor every stage, and access to the area is tightly controlled.